Hey, what's going on guys? So today I'm here to give you a brief explanation on what is Frame Arms. Frame Arms is a line of model kits first developed by Kotobukiya back in 2009 and since then has come out with dozens of different model kits. It all started with the original architect frame and the entire concept of Frame Arms is that frame refers to the core of the body inside the robot that is shared between all the robots and arms, meaning the outer armor that is suited onto the frame. And by using this concept, the models deliver a unique building experience and they're highly customizable. But if you're looking through some frame arms kits, there's a number of terms to familiarize yourself with. Number one being the RE label on some of the model kits. This stands for renewal. Basically what this is, is the model kit has been reissued with improvements to either the color separation or to the internal architect frame, as in the model kit is using the updated renewal version of the architect frame, which features improvements to the frame itself. There is also FME versions of frame arms model kits. This stands for four modelers editions. Essentially what these are is a version of the model kit or a version of the armor for a particular model kit that is molded in neutral colors, usually white and off-white. And this is ideal for painting and easier customization and kit bashing. And then there is also available weapon sets and extend arms sets. Extend arm sets are additional equipment sets that are usually designed for a specific model in the line. But like with everything else in the frame arms line is easy to customize with any particular model that you might so choose. Aside from all that, there is also a very wide range of MSG or modeling support goods available. This would be optional weapons, armor, equipment, things like that that you can buy that will work with any of the Frame Arms model kits. So as you can see, the real focus of Frame Arms is for the modeler to be creative and customize them, although you don't have to do that. That is certainly one of the most fun aspects about the model kits and I highly recommend them. If you guys would like to check out some Frame Arms kits for yourself, check the link down in the video description below. But what do you all think of the Frame Arms line? You can let us know down in the comment section below. Do you have a particular favorite release out in the line you can let us know thank you all so much for checking out the video today hope that was helpful for everyone until next time have a good one bye bye